You ready for the boss of number two? Boss time! All right, this time I'm not gonna use the dagger. Oh, I see. I guess I'm assuming I need to hit your face. I don't like what this is going. Yep, I need to hit his face. So, the Avoiding nose, the trunk. The trunk is the big bad of this. Yeah. He will charge all the way to the left and you have to... Oh, I need to hit him to get him to stop. Hitting the trunk repeatedly will shrink it temporarily. I see. But it does grow. This is the fight where I've always had to balance, do I want to use sword or do I want to use dagger? Yeah, I can see where dagger's gonna be effective here. Oh, I gotta climb back up to this guy. No, you don't. He's in the basement. Oh, that's true. They actually were kind on this one. What the? You just left. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, Brendan, hold right. Never trust left. Don't trust me. Also, clearly they aren't going to change the... Uh... Oh, but I still got to get back over there. I mean, you can just run. Run and jump. You know what? You're not wrong. And smack a turtle on the way. The turtle smacked me, let's be honest here. <laughs> I like how some of these guys take... Some of the little dudes take one hit, and others take multiple hits. Yeah. I don't think I can... just get over there. Yeah, you can. I don't think I can jump that, Tim. I'm not talking about that. No, no, Brendan. Go up and to the right. And fall. Oh, ho! Wait, what was over here? Did I already do this stuff? Oh, this is... Yeah. Okay. I see now. Yes. You have solved the mystery. Whee! And now you're here. Okay, so that that little portion is a little bit geometry weird, but whatever. I mean, it's a door. You can assume staircase brought you weird places. Yeah. It is basement after all. Yeah, I, I can I can forgive that one. It's just a little bit fucky with my head, but whatever. Could be worse. Could definitely be worse. It's not conquer levels. Not many things are. No. All right. Round two. Round two. So daggers are actually not very bad in this one because the way the trunk works, um, the trunk just shrinks with any damage. I feel like I should probably use the fire sword to get him out of the ice first. Probably. That's probably going to be more, much more beneficial to me. It's when he's out of the ice that... Yeah. And then switch over... Dagger. Yeah, because really, as long as I stay right here, I can't get hurt anymore. Yeah, daggers aside, this is probably one of the harder bosses, just because the trunk is such a, well... It's a very big hitbox. It's a very large nuisance. And I think the way that the developers wanted to get around that was the whole hitting it shrinks it thing. Yeah. So this is a gonna be a lengthy boss fight, but at this point, there's definitely no issue with me being able to do it. I mean, you can mess up. I mean, I could. 
Um, for what it's worth, this is, I'd say, the last boss where dra daggers can legitimately be a strat. Fair. Everything else, you gotta throw up your big boy pants on <laughs> and actually take a sword to it. I've just played this game enough and long enough to where I no longer use daggers in this fight. But I've also beaten the game a few times, yeah. so... Whereas this is my introduction to this game. <laughs> exactly. I think first time through, there is no shame in using daggers in this fight. Because it is kind of tricky to attack the eyes without getting hit by Trunk. No. Yeah. Because you also have to factor in with the sword you're not necessarily shrinking the trunk at all. Yeah. And the only way to dodge that charge... Is to fully shrink the trunk. No. Um, well, at least mostly shrink the trunk. No, you can dodge it without shrinking it at all. But it's a very specific jump in the corner that you have to time. Ah, uh, fair. To where it's doable, but it's pretty heavy on the timing. Oh boy, this guy has a lot of health. Yes. And I'm doing very little damage. Yes. It Safety strats are not fast strats. No. But they're safe. Yes. And they work. Eventually. Hey! There you go. Alright. You have beat the second boss. Let's just go ahead and not have that Put equipped. Put on the Widowmakers. <laughs> Found the Star Stone! You sure did. So now I can shrink more statue things. Alright, cool. Higgins hears a voice. My name is Tia. I lost my memory in a store. Oh, what what a coincidence. I also lost my memory in a storm and landed here and met the king. I didn't get set to be married to him though. See, they never specifically say how much time has passed. Yeah. And, and this is Higgins talking. Yeah. Really? Well, that's very daring of you. You seem to remind me of someone. Someone special. Yeah. Huh. The theme of the game is very slow realization of... Oh. Oh, hang on. I see. Wait, what? <laughs> Oh, I'm helping the king marry my bride. Hmm. Well, it's okay. I'm a great warrior. I'll just take her back. I still haven't been able to decide if I like or hate that storyline of helping someone else get your wife. <laughs> but it's amusing nonetheless. I mean, don't kink shame. Yeah. That's fair. Oh, look. Alright. Got a treasure. It's a wand. I got a wand. Alright, I have magic now. This is the magic wand. Legendary throughout the land. Just hanging out. You'll learn a new trick each time you find a matching magic bottle. So the way you learn magic in this game is, uh, much like you pick up life bottles, you can pick up magic bottles. And each time you get a new magic bottle, you learn the next spell each spell kind of, well, costs the associating magic. Level 2 costs 2 magic, level 3 costs 3 magic, so on and so forth. Alright, and the magic I just got will return me to the beginning of a stage. Yes. So it's my exit magic. Correct. There's dragons. He's doing his best. They're doing their best. That's kind of the running theme for a lot of the enemies in this <laughs> game is th they do their best. Alright. Um, I'm not entirely sure where to go now. Go check out the far right again one more time for me, please. Sure. Maybe. <laughs> it's okay. At least I have a better sword now. You deal damage and you take less damage now. As I continue to use my raft of wonders. Go in that spike for me, please. He's a good boy. 
I do enjoy the basic character or enemy design in this game sometimes. Okay. Got more treasure. We got the sun ring. You sure did. What is that? All right. Guessing it's equipment. Causes volcanoes to erupt. Well, I know a place with volcanoes. You, okay. So. I see you're following this game's train of logic. Let's go erupt some volcanoes because clearly that's not going to cause problems. <laughs> yeah. Part of me wonders if this game had like another couple years to develop and a bit more of a budget, how much bigger would it be and would that necessarily make it better? Yeah, it would have been interesting. Like, although, uh, if they took too long, you know it would have just gotten bogged down. Yeah. By, like, all right, these, uh, these shoot 'em ups are, uh, <laughs> are popular. Let's just put in a new section. Oh, we'll move it over to the 64. Right. <laughs> the volcano erupted and blew the gate down! Thankfully, it did not blow down Master Higgins in the process. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. It's not going to cause issues. It's definitely not going to cause lava pools that I have to jump over. But it does open up World 3. But it opens up World 3. The Funk Land. The Land of Funk. Alright. Cool. Uh, oh, okay. I have a new rideable. Mm-hmm. I feel like my fire sword shouldn't be super effective here. It's but... not. But it's also still the best thing you have. Eh, it works. It works. Wow, those guys are really just... doing their thing. I can't get further up yet. I can go down. I can't go down that. Okay, I'm going down this then. This is the other world that kinda has weird illusion tricks to it. Oh, I see. Okay. The coolest of the moles. The Monty Mole and all up in this lava world. If I, I don't hit the, oh. Yeah, run to your right. Did I mention that sometimes I get trouble with my rights and my lefts? <laughs> Do you? <laughs> I wasn't going to say much. Alright. But I'm kind of curious what was further over. Nothing. I also can't get back up there, so... I mean, you can, but... Or... It doesn't appear I can. How did that not kill me? It's just another hazard. Okay. I should really let go of the run button. <laughs> <laughs> Once you get a feel for it, you don't really have to, but it does kind of mess with the physics a little bit. It makes you very slippery. And I've got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, Adamant no. Toys. They actually do something now. They move and they hide. They move and hide. And make my sword go tink. <laughs> All right. I want to get in the thing I was in before, although I have no idea where I am now. I'm getting treasure. Ice armor. All right. I'm assuming that that would be good against the heat. Usually. Wait, what did it say? Works, works well in the heat. I definitely read that as works hell in the heat. <laughs> the W's and the H's, they kind of they kind of blend. And now I just look rad. <laughs> a fan of them blues. I'm just sporting my blue armor over here. All right. You've been here before. Been here Run. before. All right. Run or you shall get crushed. Oh, I can't go further down. No. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. It's bigger than I thought it was. At least those things die to one hit now. Mm -hmm. I would really appreciate some life drops, but... You don't like being on Magic Pixel Life? 
Not particularly. Hey, that's a, that's a bit of a help. <sighs> that's not as much of a help. <laughs> but that is. So I'll take it. Should really let go of the run button. Now that you know it's there, you have to. <laughs> you feel obligated to use it a bit. I mean, I I have a go fast button. How can I? How can I not use my go fast button? The go fast button is good, but it does very much change how the game plays. Tink 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 dead. All right. Well, let's try going to the. Uh, oh. For those so watching, just here. to kind of put it in perspective, the go fast button. Uh, almost applies ice physics to Master Higgins. Yeah, it kind of does. You do want to go to the right. You already looked at everything on your left, I believe. All right, fair enough. Well, you know, I think I will continue going to the right in our next episode of Super Adventure Island 2. 